Take a look. This is beautiful out there right now, but of course we're uh, getting the blue blowing dust and sand out there, but even more so over the next couple of days, getting taller hair out there. looks like that right now. Take a look. Uh, so, so far so good. Here's the setup. Wind tracker, 13 first alert. Your first alert is we're adding an extra day. That would be Thursday, but no picnic tomorrow. Look at that. We've got the southwesterly flow, still a drier flow. That's the pleasant part, but those stronger winds continue. So they'll really pick up in the afternoon and even in the overnight hours, it looks like they'll still be peaking. Look at that 1 a.m. and we're still seeing double digit wind speed across the valley. These are sustained winds. This is not a gust tracker per se, so we know gusts will be higher. Could even get closer to 30, 35 miles an hour, but uh, definitely through Thursday and early parts of the afternoon, we'll just see it ramping up, but we're going to keep them in at least through Thursday. So now not just Wednesday, Thursday as well. That's your first alert. Uh, bottom line for tonight is temperatures just continue to drop and they'll get even nicer yet over the next few days as we cool things down. So very soon overnight lows will be in the 70s, uh, lower 70s at that. So that'll be also oh pleasant. 13 first alert desert Doppler dry now. And when I show you computer models, what they're showing in our future cast, uh, you're not going to see a whole lot of activity here. And maybe that's good for some of you. Maybe you're a little tired of all that moisture bubbling up down near Tucson right now out through Albuquerque. But it's not coming here. Nothing's shifting this way. Remember, the southwesterly flow continues, and that makes a big difference in how it feels across the valley. So all the moisture is suppressed down to the south and out toward the east. And for us, it's all about 90s, more 90s than 100s. Just not lower 90s yet, but that's okay. It's, it's, it's fine. Gusty at times for a few days. There's your lower 70 right there. Uh, staying generally in the middle 70s, but we keep those 70s dropping as the 90s continue through uh, the weekend and next week. Might see a few clouds in the picture, but really a very nice looking forecast. You can just get past the wind because the drier spell is just making 90s feel oh so good. So once again, some stronger winds, 20 to even 40 miles per hour the next few days. Back to you guys. Okay.